Hi everyone, here we are going to use multi-agent collaboration for financial analysis. Here we are going to use Crew.ai which is both a framework and a service that lets you create and run multi-agent autonomously. Here we are going to install Crew.ai and Crew Tools, Lang, Chain, Community and Together. So Together helps us in order to run open source large language model. So here we are going to use Meta Llama 3.1405 billion instruct model. And this is an way to use that model. Here we are going to pass in parameters. Here we have to provide the together API key to use that model. And also because we are using the super API key to scrape websites like Google. So here we have to provide the super API key. And we are also in from Crew Tools, we are in using a search tool and a scraper tool. So first we are going to create an agent. So there are four agents that you are going to have. One is the data analysis agent whose role is going to be a data analyst. Goal is to monetize, monitor and analyze market data in real time to identify trends and predict market movements. Specializing in financial market, this agent is going to use a statistical modeling machine learning. So we are going to give a backstory we are going to allow verbose and allow delegation and the tools that is going to have is going to be script tool and a search tool. Now our trading strategy agent who is going to create a strategy for our trading bot. So whatever agent that we are going to have and its primary goal is to develop and test various trading strategies based on insights from the data analyst agent. So based on the information that is going to get from the data analyst, it is going to create a trading strategy and he's going to have a backstory. Backstory is basically equipped with the deep understanding of financial market and other information. Then there is an execution agent who is a trade advisor, suggest optimal trade execution strategies based on approved trading strategies. This agent is going to specialize in analysis in the timing, price and logistical details. By evaluating this factor, it provides well-found strategies on how to trade should be executed to maximize efficiency and adherence to strategy. He is also going to get the tools like scrape and search tool. And at last, a risk management agent, a risk advisor, who is going to evaluate and provide insights on the risk associated with the particular trading activities, armed with the a backstory is like armed with deep understanding of risk assessment model, market dynamics, agents scrutinize the potential of risk of proposed strategies. It offers detailed analysis of the risk exposure and all the other information. Now the first task that we are going to do is that data analysis task. So here the description is like we have to continuously monitor and analyze data for the selected stock and we are going to pass in whichever stock we want to do. So here you are passing it in form of a curly bracket and use statistical modeling and machine learning to identify trends and predict market movements, insights and alert for the efficient market opportunities or threats of this particular stock. Now we are going to do a task for these trading strategies agent. So develop and refine trading strategies based on the insights from the data analyst and use predefined risk tolerance. So user is going to provide a risk tolerance and the trading strategy preference. So these are the two parameters we are going to get. And expected would be a set of potential trading strategies for the current stock that aligns with the user risk tolerance. Then another we are going to be an execution planning task. So analyze and approve the trading strategies which has been given by our trading strategy agent and create the best execution method for that particular stock or stock selection. Consider current market condition and optimal pricing and the expected output would be like detailed execution plan suggesting how and when the to execute that strategy or to execute that planning. And also at last again a risk assessment task. So evaluate the risk associated with the proposed trading strategy. Evaluate strategies, execute plans for that particular stock, provide a detailed analysis for that potential risk and suggest mitigation strategies, a comprehensive risk analysis and reporting detailed potential. 
and here the agent is going to pass in the rig strategies agent and whatever agents require so every task is going to have an agent once that is done we are going to have our crew running and here we have to write a process so from crew.ai we are importing the process so financial trading crew so crew the agents that here we are going to pass so our data analysis agent trading strategy agent execution agent and risk management agent and the task is data analysis task strategy development task execution planning task and risk assessment task and the manager llm so here we are saying that we are going to use meta llama 3.1 billion instruct turbo model and the max tokens we can pass in the temperatures and the process is going to be in hierarchical order so basically the first we are going to run the data analysis task then strategy development task then execution planning task and risk assessment task and once that is done we are going to get the output so here if you had looked into our agents right so there is a stock selection that we are requiring to inputs so here while running this we are going to take the input so here we have chosen the stock selection AAPL which is the Apple stock what is our initial capital what is our risk tolerance what is this trading strategy and news market consideration let's say if you want to include right what are the news happening is it a positive news or is it a negative news so based on that uh, planning needs to be done so here entire thing is given and we are running our financial trading crew so we are kicking off it with the particular inputs and if I go and see right how it started so the initially right the crew execution gets started so here it is reading from the Yahoo Finance and getting all the information so once that is done right so again it is looking into other information what are the different information based on it so what is the risk tolerance so it is going through a lot of chain of thoughts that is going there and based on all those information right so from investopia it is getting information it is going to get information from two three websites aggregate those looking into the different strategies and if i scroll down so there are multiple chain of thoughts that are happening so all of the agent right the data analysis trading strategy and all of them are working in a hierarchical order and once all this information is collected and all of them have finalized as you could see the risk analysis is happening and once those chain of thoughts is done right so we are going to get our result so at the end right we are going to get a risk analysis report for the apple trading strategy so if you are doing it in an aggressive way right it is saying that the what are the potential risk so high volatility the market could lead to significant losses and increased exposure to APL stocks over reliance on short term trading strategies may result in missed long term potential so it is saying that doing an intraday trading is not a very good option for the Apple stocks implement stop loss order to limit potential losses during market turn downs and diversify your portfolio with high growth stock to balance the risk exposure because apple is already an over is an well established stock so there the potential of it of its growth is very limited so it is saying that you can use or you can choose some other stock from the stock market instead of going to apple so if it's a moderate strategy again the same thing and it's also uh, expecting you to consider hedging strategies to protect again interest rate risk and if you're a very conservative right it is saying uh, to maintain a cash reserve for liquidity needs to take advantage of market opportunities and diversify into income generating assets such as dividend paying stocks and in the potential this it is saying that the returns from the apple may not keep up with inflation leading to loss of purchasing power and changes in interest rate could lead to an impact of performance and bond investment 
So this is the entire idea of creating multi-agent system for a financial analysis on a particular stock. So that's all.